hi aries hello welcome back to my channel all right aries so we are going to go ahead and get started on your new moon and sagittarius reading yay if you do hear the lawnmowers i just finished libra they actually started in libra's reading okay just just so you guys know um and like i said they came out in libra's reading i said and usually by now they would be done if they were cutting the grass today but I, but it was part of Libra's message. But if y'all hear them again, they're part of y'all's too, period. All right, so we're going to go ahead and get the uh, message for you. See what is the most important for you to know right now. Please know that when you see it is when you're meant to see it, Aries. If you need to refer back to it later, please do. It is general. It is collective. I don't control the message. I do everything right here with you guys. So I'm just now learning the message when you get it, okay? Um... But yeah, we're going to see what this new moon is talking about. The Patreon link is below if you're interested in love and career readings, plus extra content and bonus divine masculine, divine feminine readings and extra readings, period. Like it's none of it is cross shared. Um, it's just a special little community over there at Patreon. The link is below. Um, also still not doing personal readings and that's it. Let's go ahead and get into it. Okay. Thank y'all for all the support. I'm very, 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 very grateful. I'm thankful for you guys. Okay. And I hope y'all enjoy your season. I love the holidays. Just a fun fact about me. I love the holidays. Um, and I'm just excited and I'm still working with you guys. I'm still working. I'm not off work, you know, like, you know, I got something that I got to do for Patreon tomorrow. So, or I plan to Patreon. If you here, don't hold me to that, but I plan to. That is my plan. Okay. Just letting y'all know. All right. It says the void. Stop. Embrace winter. Great cosmic womb. All right. And this says the cosmic heart. Devotion. Potency. Make your life a moving prayer. Okay, all right, now here he is. This says stop, embrace winter. Great cosmic womb. And then the cosmic heart. So something definitely deals with the cosmos here. Holy Spirit, Holy, Holy Angels, Ancestors, Spirit Guides, those from highest white light who walk with me every day. Or something beyond where you don't see. I just heard galaxy. I don't know. Maybe the word galaxy. Maybe that's a maybe that's a street name or um, as well, you know, or something like that, or a name of business or something. Holy Spirit, holy angels, ancestors, spirit guides, those from highest white light. What we got for Aries? Archangel Michael, please protect me as I tell the messages for Aries. Block any interference that stops their messages from coming through. Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, North Node, and Venus. What we got for Aries today? What's the story? What's the what's the, what's this for Aries? Thank you. Wow. Well, I be doggone. Y'all seen me shuffle them cards up. Sabrosa, hidden in plain sight, mysteries, learning, and teaching. Libra just got that. They did. I just finished Libra. This says Sophia, divine plan, wisdom, intelligence within destiny. So the name Sophia could be significant as well. Okay. Or, you know, something. Wisdom, intelligence within destiny, hidden in plain sight, mysteries, learning, and teachers, teaching. All right. So let's see what the message is. What do we have for Aries today? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, Ancestors, Spirit, those from the highest white light who walk with me every day. I cannot believe this. That card came right back out. <laughs> Somebody could have Libra highly aspected. Okay. Or you're dealing with one. What's the message? What's the message for Aries? All right, you got the Eight of Swords. Somebody could be trapped in their head. This could be a Leo, okay? Um, somebody's stuck in their head about something, okay? Or somebody has a tight hold on them, a tight grip. So 
something be going on, could be going on with somebody's mental state okay somebody's sad or hurt or something's going on with somebody's mental something's going on with somebody's thoughts here look at this five of swords yeah air sign up on you aries i mean come on now uh, you up on somebody you up on this air sign all right you got a tower here it looks like something blew up some kind of hate malice slander something like that now somebody's like dang let me try to figure it out. I don't know. Eight of, I meant I'm talking to eight. Um, the six of swords with the queen of pentacles. Yeah, somebody was trying to run off on you here. Is what it looks like. You were trying to run off on somebody, Aries, but something was blocked. All right. Um, and it looks like something is backfiring and it could lay somebody out here. There's going to be a new beginning here with the ace of wands. You got the dev card, the ten of swords, and this is what somebody is thinking. Um, somebody could be trying to, you know, yeah, mm -hmm. something's going on. I don't know. Somebody could be trying to, you know, distance themselves from a situation or this is you. Maybe you've distanced yourself from some kind of situation. Maybe you knew something was bound to blow up. Something could, something could have something to do with somebody's father or a father figure. There could be a betrayal here or something like that. Yeah. Yeah, there's something going on with someone's dad here. Yeah, something shocking or tragic has happened. All right, let's see. What is this? All right, so the the seven of seven of pentacles, the way it came out on my hand, it turned around and then reversed. So I'm gonna keep it up right. You know, we'll read it either way. It still means time, money, and energy. Somebody could be heartbroken because it's something is depleting. Their savings are going away, or something doesn't look financially great like it used to be. Their investments, you know, they they seeing lack in places. They're not seeing anything gain anything or something like that. Okay. Or they're watching something with you grow. Just put it, take it how it resonate, resonates, Aries. What we got? All right, you got the Ten of Cups here. Something I can have something to do with someone's family or a heartbroken family. You got the Four of Cups here. You got the Ten of Wands here, okay? So it looks like somebody feels very burdened. They have more bills than they have money or, or something is coming up. Something could be like new expenses or somebody is like why is this like that this could be somebody that you were partnered up with or somebody's partner or something like that this could be somebody's husband wife whoever whoever they're partnered up somebody somebody could just feel like they have a lot of responsibilities here um i don't know you got uh, scorpio and cancer energy in your reading as well maybe this is somebody's um uh, main placements maybe something you know just deals with someone who has a lot of air in their chart or that's you Maybe you have a lot of air in your chart. I mean, I don't know. I just feel like something is a waste. Something is a waste here with the seven of pentacles and the four of cups. And it wanted to, we don't know if it wanted to come out in the reverse or not, but something is a waste. Something is not moving forward or moving up or adding up or, and that could be what it is. Something's not adding up. Something's not working anymore. I don't know what, what, what was, but somebody is stressing over something not working. Mm-hmm. Somebody could have to take care of a whole household or they have to hold something together. It could something could have something too to do with two endings, two separate endings. You got a happy ending on one and a burden ending on the other. So I don't know who's who put everybody where they go, Aries. Four of Pentacles. You got the sun card. Maybe somebody was told to stop and they didn't. Page of Pentacles. Queen of Wands, Queen of Cups, okay, <laughs> Seven of Cups, okay, so something can have something to do with just women, something can have something to do with women, maybe women hate you, masculine or feminine, women can hate you, or somebody has a lot of women, or I don't know, <laughs> It's something going on here, but it looks like something that you built from scratch. Something is growing beautifully. 
All right, but it's somebody else is in lack. And this could be somebody that you used to be friends with. Maybe you had fake friends. That could be what this is. You had a frenemy. Or somebody, this just gives me hate, like, for no reason. I mean, because you got, you got something that's actually, if it was started from scratch and initiated by you, Aries, with the Queen of Wands here. And you just doing what makes you happy, just trying to make you some money is what it looks like to me. And you're wanting something to grow. You're planting seeds, and, and but it's just like you have on looking hate. I just feel like people just want to play with you. It's what this gives me. Because they feel like they can. Go watch the Libra reading. Just saying. What's wrong with these people? I don't know. Maybe this person was a Libra. The hair ring leader that was hating on you was a Libra. I don't know, baby. I guess it's unimportant. They blend in these ten of cups or ten of wands. Whichever one. This could be two separate groups. But it says divine plan, wisdom, intelligence, within, destiny, hidden in plain sight, mysteries, learning, and teaching. So somebody's learning a lesson here. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Maybe you show up looking like you ain't got nothing, like you don't have sense or something like that. Major Arcana in your spread is the tower and the chariot. Okay. Um, with the sun card being over here, something is about to blow for you period that, that's all it is and it's gonna be it's like an outpouring it's for your great decision making that's what this is that's that's what this is here this is fast forward movement okay then you got the tower right here somebody was trying to block this for you uh block you from uh meeting a new friend or being friends with somebody being with somebody having your ten of cups somebody was trying to block this for you but you're going to be happy in the end. Whatever this is that's blowing up for you, and it's going to be a lot. Like, it's, you're going to just feel like, <sighs> but that's why I love them are. Like, that's how you're going to feel, like, about whatever this is. Like, there's something that's going to pay off. Like, you're going to have, like, multiple offers, multiple handouts, multiple everything, Aries. It just... It just depends on what you, you know what you've been invested in. Something is gonna work in your favor here, okay? Let me get one, please, on the tower. It's gonna shock you. It's gonna not only shock these people because they're gonna be like, "Man, we tried so hard to take Aries Ten of Cups away and burden them." Now Aries, now you got the two of, the Ten of Cups twice. <laughs> you see how that works? And now somebody's sad. And they like, why me? I don't know who this hating behind water sign feminine is. I don't know who this is. Maybe they're not a water sign. Maybe they just got some kids. Maybe they somebody hating baby mama. Maybe they just, I don't know, stay in their feelings. I don't know. I don't know who this is. This could be somebody's partner. This could be a Scorpio. For some people. Could be a Cancer. Could be a Scorpio. Could be anybody, but it's some endings being passed out around this joint. A lot of endings. Okay, you got three already. I'm telling you. Let me get one on the uh, chariot. Yeah, whatever this is, you're going to be smiling from ear to ear. The chariot. <laughs> Look at this. Another ending. Dang, Aries. <laughs> Aries, they better not play with you. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Look. Okay, uh-uh. They better not play with you. Something could really be up with somebody's dad, though. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Or somebody's boss. Something has something to do with somebody's boss, but I think it's something that really has something to do with somebody's dad. Mm-hmm. Or a baby father. Mm-hmm. Something have something to do with the, like with this chariot being here and this ten of swords in the tower card with the ten of wand, uh ten of wands here. Something have something to do with like a car crash or something like that. You just went the, from two endings to four endings with two clarifications, Aries. Can I get one on the sign? 
You're gonna have it's like somebody is like unwed, but that marriage material they're unwed. Somebody's been trying to block you from having the whole thing. Um, they're finally having your glory, finally having what you deserve or what you've been wanting and striving for for so long. You've just had to face a lot of challenges, is what it looks like. A lot of obstacles, a lot of blockages. You've been constantly having to move things and people out of your way that want to come in your lane. And it looks like that's what's going on right here. Things are moving out of the way. Okay, the sun. But they all will be able to see, okay? It looks like the Most High is making your enemies your footstool, or that's what they have done. The sun is clarified by the hermit. Hidden in plain sight. Yeah. I don't know. Something's being exposed here, okay? Something, someone, whoever this person is that be hating on you. Could be a Leo. I don't know. Or who you be hating on, Aries. Maybe you be hating on the Leo. I don't know. The sun is clarified by the hermit. Following the hermit is the five of swords in the in the strength card. You got the judgment card behind that. Ace of swords behind that. Seven of swords behind that. So the lies, the lies could be seen. The slander can be seen. The theft could be seen. That's what this is. Something deals with copycat too. Copycats. I don't know what 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 that would be. But I feel like a lot of people are experiencing towers and they, they probably don't know why. But I don't know. Aries, you're reading kind of. Mm. But it says devotion, potency, make your life a moving prayer. Maybe somebody needs to pray more. And this says stop, embrace winter, great cosmic womb. Mm. I just feel like the things are being eliminated. Like seriously, I'm just really getting like something is completely being eliminated. Like, uh, or this is what somebody that you know, it's it's. Uh, Mm. I just don't your only two major arcana in your main spread is clarified by two endings so I don't know Aries if it was somebody and their partner coming against you and that could be what it is this kind of gives me kind of the, the cancer energy feel where I said something about it'd be it's somebody and like their wife or something like that. Or this is somebody's wife or or something. It's a lot of endings out here, like like in different places, like something is gonna be like a mystery. Whatever this is, it's going to be a mystery. Like literally, like unsolved. Something is a mystery. It's unsolved. It's going to be unsolved. Real strange. Just like that Libra. I feel like that Libra reading was real strange. This reading kind of strange. I don't know. Maybe the Libra reading and the Aries reading kind of go together. When Mars is in, in retrograde. Maybe this is the Libra reading and your reading is the your Le the Aries reading is really the Ari the Libra reading. Take it how it resonates though. The end of a tough cycle approaches. Yeah. Like I said, this is an ending. This is a good ending for you. Something you're gonna be happy about. Yo, yo hidden helpers getting your lick back. That's what I'm telling you. Something is a mystery. Like, like, it's like you can see it, but it can't be explained. The hermit on the sun. These are cosmic. This is stuff that's just. It's people there, but they're not there. 
it's like these are people like cutting people brake cords and stuff and they car and ooh, I don't know. But I'm telling you, it's like they taking like they are really taking people by the throat right here. And like your people getting your lick back. They taking your stuff back. Is what this is giving me. Aries, you got to read in this called you getting your stuff back or something like that. I'm going to tag it below. Maybe it'll resonate for you better because this is just nothing but endings. You're very close to achieving your goal. I forgot who got that nothing is yet set in stone card. I know Taurus got it and somebody else got it. I can't remember. I can't remember Pisces maybe. Well, anyway, Aries, you got a weird read in there. Congratulations. If it's for you, you will get it. Anyway, I don't know. Go watch the Libra reading. Watch the Aries reading. I pinned below. Um, definitely check out the Patreon link to see what tiers uh, fit you best. And y'all have a happy Thanksgiving. Bye.